tip number 13 and uh, this is a long one again be aware if a connector should be placed directly on the edge of PCB or if it should be moved out of the board a little bit out I'm going to explain this is what I mean yeah when uh, you are placing these kind of connectors which you can see here on your board you may want to think if you would like to place them exactly on the edge of PCB like this USB connector can you see it is exactly on the edge of PCB or if you would like to place them a little bit out like this Ethernet connector see it is moved a little bit out of the PCB what do you think of why we place the connectors this way it's because uh, if your board is going to be mounted in uh, a metal enclosure it is very important that these uh, connectors the shield of these connectors is touching the enclosure and uh, better the contact is better the contact between this connector and the enclosure is the it's better for EMC and for ESD testing. It's better for the results of these kind of tests. If you have a look on these connectors, there are some differences. This Ethernet connector, it has some springs here, see? And uh, that's the reason why we moved it a little bit out of the board. Basically what is happening, if you mount the board inside the enclosure and you place panel on the, in the enclosure or on the enclosure, this connector is going to be inserted into the hole in the panel and these springs here, they will be touching the edges of the hole in the panel. This connector is a little bit different, yeah? there are no springs, so uh, basically what we done here is when the panel is mounted, this frame, which is here, will be touching the panel. Okay, so don't forget. Tip number 13. Be aware if a connector should be placed directly on the edge of PCB or if it should be moved out of the board. Why? You may want the connectors to be touching the enclosure. Some connectors have springs, others have panel around them.